Hey guys, but Airsoft here. I had to do a new loadout for a contest that I was wanting to enter. And he said it had to be a brand making new loadout. So this is going to you. You know who you are. Um, this is my Woodland Field Summertime loadout. During the winter, like if I'm in the woods, it really doesn't snow around here in Texas. So I would be wearing pants and a shirt would be actually be scrolled down. But there it is rolled up and I am wearing a lot of shorts. I really don't care about getting hit, but it does what its purpose is. So I'm gonna start off with my mask and everything else guys. Uh I am wearing a JT paintball mask. Actually, it's a paintball slash airsoft mask, but it has a full face guard and it works really nice. So there's that. There's the JT airsoft mask. I'm wearing just a normal camouflage, pretty much all hunting one fit hunting hat. Camo, very nice. I like wearing it. Just protects my head, that kind of thing. Um, protects my neck actually. I, I put it down like this and it protects your neck. So if you get shot in the back. Okay, next thing I'm wearing, I'm wearing my JT paintball full uh, shield hand gloves with grip on the bottom. These come very handy, especially when you're coming around corners, that kind of thing. Around trees and all you can see is your hands and your face. You don't get popped in those hands a heck of a lot. At the end, guys, I'm going to put it all back on and I'm going to do like one last little look at it. That kind of thing. Okay, I'm wearing my SWAT tactical vest, real SWAT tactical vest. I have pouch, 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 pistol mag pouches, main pouch, CO2 cartridges in here. I already took one out. There's one right there. Uh, nothing in this pocket. Radio pouch here. Do carry a radio sometimes. Um, this was a real SWAT vest. I am just now recently bought two extra uh, M4 mags off of Airsoft GI and I bought a Molly vest. Uh, so you'll be seeing that in some videos, just so y'all know. Um, I'm going to take this off. Okay. This side being annoying. Very much so. You know what? Get over there. Okay. Next thing, guys, is that this is my hydration carrier. I wear this underneath my vest. Where's the tube? Where did it go? Hold on. This is really starting to get annoying with this thing. This tube likes to uh, disappear and go back into this, and there it is. Here's my hydration carrier. So it's just my little water sack with my water tube. I carry extra BBs, uh, extra mags for other people to use. Um, cheap. I carry a cheap little sprayer right here. So somebody's guns break down, and well, I don't have anything to loan them, because I already say loaned up my gas pistol or something like that. Uh, I'll hand them the Springer right there. I have like two extra mags for it, and it does the purpose. I just get them to stay behind me until we can get them to a respawn point or something like that to fix their gun. But that is the Coleman Max carrier with reflectors on there. Okay, next thing guys, I'm just wearing a OD type green shirt. I wear it tucked in and I wear camouflage like the hat. Shorts, cargo shorts. Very nice shirt for purpose. Got my tan legs. Uh, wear tennis shoes. Very nice track shoes actually. So they get some good grip on the floor and on the ground when I need them to. I'm actually really skinny. Huh. But, so it really works out. Okay, next to the guns, I have my standard M4 carbine. Um, getting a weaver rail for the bottom for this thing and two extra mags, like I already said. With the weaver rail, probably have a vertical grip or a bipod vertical grip or something on this thing, so it looks really nice. Uh, I have my BSA red dot on this. Comes in handy in the field. Take out people in the head. Pop, 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 pop. So that works out pretty nice. Uh, no flash riders, y'all can see now, guys. That's kind of retarded, but okay. Uh, in the field, if I'm going around, if it's like really tree, 
I kind of put it into like one or second position. And that's how I'll play if it's like a bunch of trees everywhere. I'd be using vertical grip. But there's a bunch of trees and stuff everywhere. But if it is pretty much just wide open fields and you say there is a few buildings or anything, I'll put it in the last position of the stock and come around the corners and everything like this. Just because it, I like it like that. It gives me a good length on my weapon. And as I said, guys, if I'm coming in buildings, I need something that's going to protect me while I am bursting into that building. And here is my TSC tactical shotgun. Shoots about 340 FPS and AGM shoots about 380. So this works for CQB and for bursting in buildings and that kind of thing. So there's that. I have one mag for this. I'm going to have three high caps for the M4. Um, forget me putting back on the gear, guys. Uh, don't have time in the video for time's sake. So, thanks. Hopefully this is good. Signing off.